Hey there kiddos and flame sprayers and paint makers. We did it! We have a big giant white ass billboard. I uh, took a play from Michael's <coughs> um, book and uh, it's kind of funny because I went to Lowe's to get some fresh paint. I, got, I bought paint in February but I wasn't sure it was going to still be good and might be all gluey so I went to pick up some new paint. I was hoping I could find something like I wanted to go like a farm green, but it all has to be mixed up to get color. So I just said, fuck it, go with a white. Funny part was I picked up a $10, you know, tray set and I thought, yeah, that'll be good enough. I'll just do it manually. And then I went to um, China Tool Place, 30 bucks for a um, airless, you know sprayer and when I look at the time savings holy cow I got that thing done in like maybe less than an hour maybe a little more counting the cleanup and stuff um, it oversprayed like hell my biggest fault is that I'm not a good attention to detail kind of guy I probably should have masked the pole or sprayed the pole but anyway good enough for now I may go back someday and hand paint the pole or something I don't know we'll see so good news is we're painted uh, it's about 12 o'clock here in Live Oak this is like I sit here having a smoke break and I look at these first row of pine trees and look up at the sky that's so cool so um, it's been dry all day it's been fairly cool thunderstorms I think are coming early today gonna be here soon I think so I'm in the middle of cleanup, and uh, another another good uh, sitting spot is uh, here where I take my breaks. I can sit down and just kind of look through there into the Baptist. Very calm, very relaxing. Note to self: take your stupid $300 watch off before you start spray painting, or it's going to end up spray painted. Anyway, it's uh, going noon tomorrow. I'll hang the equipment and um, one of two choices. I got to start working the sewer piping or uh, probably more importantly, I'm going to see if I can get a uh, car dolly. And tomorrow after I hang the shit, I'll try to drag the MGs out here and get rid of the storage unit. Even though it's going to be the first, I think the gal let me slide on the rent if I get it out of there tomorrow. So, uh, yeah, that's the news that's fit to print here from beautiful Live Oak. Oh, the other thing that happened yesterday is uh, Deidre, the mail carrier, came by. Uh, she was on vacation, so there was a temporary carrier who didn't want to tell me where to put the post. Um, but Deidre says, put it wherever the hell you want. So I'm going to put it right in front of my uh, driveway, which is convenient for me. And, uh, again, that's... That's better than I expected. She initially suggested uh, put it where the gang of three already is, but uh, I said, you know, I'd prefer to have it in front of my driveway. And she said, yeah, I really don't care. As long as I can get, get into it um, from my car. They don't like to have to get out of the car in these rural areas to drop the mail off. So, yeah, that's all good. And we'll see you all later from Live Oak.